first gig, Southside the College, was at the Jacaranda, which was a, a tiny uh, little coffee bar where they played in the cellar. I think they got about uh, five shilling each. According to Ray McFall, the resident DJ, the Beatles made 292 appearances. Between 1961 and 1963, the Beatles were paid 3 pounds and 50 shillings a concert. The first concert by the Beatles at a Cavern Club over a lunchtime on February 9, 1961 was hardly an auspicious affair. They were paid 5 pounds, equivalent to 145 pounds and 40 pence in 2023 for the appearance, a concert that wasn't advertised, and Judge Harrison was nearly denied admission to play because he was wearing jeans. The small basement club wasn't full, customers were munching sandwiches and hot dogs, and not all the clientele knew what to expect at a venue that had traditionally played host since its 1957 opening to jazz stars, such as George Melly and Acker Bilk. On that landmark lunchtime, the Beatles played first of 292 concerts at the Cavern until their final appearance on August 3, 1963. Some of the Beatles had played the club before as a quarryman, but for this concert in 1961, it was the first time Harrison and Lennon and the band had been together as the Beatles at the Cavern. Harrison, then only 17, arrived in blue jeans, which were banned from the club, but he managed to convince the bouncer, Buddy Delaney, that he was the one of the performers and was allowed in. The Beatles played in other spots as well. It is rumored that each Beatle was earning about 100 pounds a week back in 1962. That's pretty good, since the average salary for a 10-year college professor was about 90 pounds per week. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> that was Ringo, folks. <laughs> well, what can I say? And goodbye to all of well, this is Ringo. Everyone seems to have said everything here, so I'll just sign off by saying cheerio and best of luck from the Beatles.